Now see how my horse, she has her nose out. You, you can do this. You're, you're more like this. Get, get low. Get more like this with your hands low. Ron's doing it. Just passenger riding with your headlight. So thinking, like I might think about the, the little wagon. See that buckboard wagon across the street? Well, I'm a little wiggly, so now I might use my rein and leg to get her on my line, but then once she finds my line, give her slack. The other thing, and Ron can watch this too, put your reins in one hand, reach up, rub the neck, reach back, rub their haunch, and be careful there, and get to where, you know, you've got your feet in your irons and your stirrups, but get to where we can really sort of sit back. I mean, don't overdo it, right? But get to where you could lean forward, stand up, and, and, and reach forward, reach back, change hands. Now, you're more like this. Be more like, let, you have to let, and you're thinking, well, she's going to go on top of my horse, and my horse will kick your horse. But there you go. Let your rein down more. Yeah, good. You need, and those ears will flop. You want the floppy ears. You want the floppy ears. Because that means what? So you're relaxing. Yep. So then reach back, reach forward. Ron can reach way back. He can reach way forward. Don't have to hold your hands up in the air all the time. Sometimes we'll put our hand on their neck. There you go. So this is more by rubbing her, you know, like you're doing and getting out of the saddle. Take one hand. I love this one. Be careful. Reach back here. I'll watch out for you. Reach back here and torso twist. Can you get to this other? S you got it. Yeah, you totally have it. And then the other side. Why would you do that? Well, yeah. So you're, yeah. So, you know, for some horses, when I reach back here, they think they're going to get hit. But this goes back to the flag lesson, conveying a clear idea. If, if a horse knows you're not going to hurt them, and Sydney, you can kind of work on riding with a headlight on your chest, point it to where you want to go, get your eyes up, be sure. You can always come around near our horses and intermingle. You're okay, just bend. Come near, yeah, that's it. And then turn and go off on your own. Look up. Give her a little, give him a little rein. It's a lot of bit for him. For you. There. There you go. Now, Brenda, I kind of left you for a little bit, but now you can work on it. Your reins are much better. Look at her ears flop. So, Sydney, look at me. You're doing awesome. Good. Relax a little. Soften the rein. Reach over. Rub his neck a little with one hand. You have to let yourself settle in and relax. Come towards me. Let him hook onto my horse a little bit. Like, let him, let him look at my horse and come on over there. Relax your body. But look at Brenda. Brenda's sitting so relaxed right now. Almost like a mushy, like we're not showing right now, right? So we don't have to sit like this. So sort of settle in like a mushy. Just relax in there. Longer rain. Now you're kind of clenching your jaw slightly, or you know what I mean? Relax. Look at me. Smile. Yeah, yeah, there you go. Pet your horse. So what I'm going to do, everybody, is just... That looks good, Ellie. See how he's settling in, licking and chewing. Watch this now. Reins in one hand. Just be part of this horse. Don't, don't regulate these horses with the reins. Let these horses explore. And you're like, I'm just with them for the ride. Reach back. Reach forward. Yeah. Eyes up. Your eyes are hard and rigid, but we want to ride with soft, open eyes. So, I mean, Ron, you know, while you can carefully, you can two hands, but be careful, you know, be able, be able to do that. Brenda could do it. So, Brenda, this one. Do it, not right now, but when you're ready. Can you let go? Settle in there, Sydney. Sit mushy. Now grab your reins. Yep. There, see? So letting them go. Just because you drop the rein, that doesn't mean you're going to lose the horse, right? They might roll. <laughs> we're so, we're so, hi. What are you doing here? Oh, I thought you were crashing the clinic. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> right. Okay. Oh, shoot. So, I think, Ellie, you're working pretty good. The biggest thing for you is, and you did it, is to get your eyes up. 
open your field of vision we can do a lesson later on on it too i know i didn't directly address you wanted you wanted a little loss of supervision on that but i thought it looked pretty good can we get him to relax equal to, to how much we can get him up and going so nice job brenda now you're cheating because you're supposed to drop the rain on the neck. How's Sydney? Sydney's here. Good. Relax, Sydney. Settle in. Now look at me once. Look at me. Come towards me. Sit like you're just, you barely have a, a backbone and you're just, just sink in there. Ron's getting a longer rain. He, he's getting it. Good. Settle in more. Now you're kind of like, settle in. Let him have his head a little bit. You know, if all you get out of the clinic today is how to get your horses to relax, that's a pretty valuable thing. 